Living Hip Hop Season 4. And we're here with Joe Budden. How you doing? Hi, Tahiri. Hi, how are you? Well, tell us a little bit about what we can expect to see from you guys this season. Juicy, crazy, passionate, love, cheating, wrong. It's typical relationship. It's ordinary love shit. I mean, it's shit that every relationship goes through. Ups, downs. It's a roller coaster ride. You just got to buckle up for it. We were together for five. We broke up for four. We got back together for two months. We've been in each other's lives for nine to ten years. That's what you do. I have great relationships with my exes. What can I say? Do you still keep in contact with your ex, Kaylin? Not at all. We don't have anything to speak about. I mean, you guys did kind of have a bond yourself, though. I mean, not as deep as you and Tahiri, but you seem like the type of guy to remain friends with your exes. I, I try to always remain amicable, number one. I mean, Kaylin's a young girl. She's a young girl. She's got some learning and some growing up to do, and, and that was a traumatizing experience for her. So, so while she may not understand it now, hopefully a few years from now she'll be able to look back and say, you know what, I respect that type of honesty because it's very rare. You know, you're not going to find that. You guys did confirm on stage tonight that you and Joey broke up. Well, I mean, he uh, tweeted about it in the middle of filming, so I mean. So then that's how you found out? No, that's not how I found out. I left. I, I was the one that broke up with him. It's just that I don't, you know, there's certain things that um, you protect. I held my relationship with Joey no matter what it seemed like very close. And um, at the moment, I was dealing with it really hard, and that was in May, June, July. And for him to tweet about it, I thought it was completely disrespectful. So. Um, you know, at times I don't feed the monster. People want to talk shit, I let them rock. Yeah, we're not together, but I mean, Terry's family for me. I love her, she loves me. We're not together, we were together, didn't work out. Can we expect for this ride to land on its feet? I would hope so. I mean, only my higher power knows. Uh, I'm gonna try my best to get it to, to, to land there, but I mean, we'll see. I mean, I'm a keeper. He fucked up. Um, I don't know what I see in the future. Um, I, at some point, I thought that I, that, that, that I, you know, I never saw me walking down the aisle of him not being the one at the end of it. Um, today, I don't know what God has in store for me. I just pray and I keep it moving. I make and I handle my handle. Whatever it is, it is. Yeah, that's what happened. I didn't cheat though. I'm not a cheater. I don't do the cheating thing. Woman is not my my problematic area. Drugs is my problem area, not women. I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't disagree with him because when I was with him back then, the first time around, um, that wasn't really an issue. Um, the new Joey, though, is really different. Um, we were separated for four years. Uh, I finally gave him another chance. Everybody seems to think that Joey and I went back and forth. We didn't. I gave him a second chance uh, in May. And um, you'll see what happens during the season. Um, but women weren't an issue. Uh, there's a lot of other things that Joey has to deal with and fighting his demons. You know, Joey has his issues. We went through some things. Like the, the, the hair on the bed, the makeup on the bed, that was that was the icing on the cake. And I mean, they covered that, so we'll be able to see that. But Tahiri and I were in therapy. Uh, we still, we I don't know if she still sees him separately, but uh, I still see him. He's great, he's amazing. And he worked wonders for, for both of us. And, and doing the show last season was therapeutic for her and I. So I mean, like you said, we have to see where we land at the end of this. We're still filming. So I mean, we gotta find out. I hate when people say, where will you see yourself in five years? Because five years ago, I didn't see myself here. There you go. So I am just doing what I do and being and we look, successful. And we look forward to keeping up. And I have 99 problems and a nigga ain't one, Joey. Okay. Peace out.